Hey everyone, it's me. I'm getting ready to film a bunch of tutorials today and I wanted to start off with my promised second part of my um, on paper towel tutorial. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. Um, I have my box right here. See, I've already started decorating it. I'm going to um, decoupage it. It has some wine labels on it. I kind of keep weird stuff, so I had some wine labels and I started doing it. So um, at any rate, see, there it is. Anyways, so here is my box. And what um, I did is I went ahead and folded them inside each other. And that way, when I pull one out like this, the next one pops right up. So it's kind of cool. It makes it really easy to deal with. And I leave it on my kitchen counter. So um, everybody in my family has kind of been um, using them a little more because, you know, they're easy. And you don't even have to open the cover to get to them. So that's that. But to get that pop-up effect, what I did is I just layered them. So um, I stacked it like this. Okay, you kind of want to know where your halfway point is. It so let me put that one there so that way I know where halfway is. See that, and then you fold it over so that it's the next one is tucked into the one before it. So now that I've done that, I'm going to do put this on the opposite side, I'm just lining it up with the edge of the one that's already folded smooth it out and then I fold this over like so and now I'm gonna put one on this side so you kind of go back and forth one side to the other um, and that way when you pull one up the next one catches so at any rate when you're done with your stack you'll fold over that last edge just set them inside the box and pull the top one through the hole and then when this comes out you can see it's gonna pull the next one up see that so at any rate, that's what I did there. Um, nice and simple, nothing too difficult or complicated there. And I have my super easy dispenser. So um, I think it's easiest to use a baby wipe box, um, but I know that there's other options. That's just kind of a good way to keep that box out of um, the trash anyways. If you put a like note on Facebook, whenever I want something for a craft, I just <laughs> will go ahead and put it on my Facebook page, my personal page. And usually there's a bunch of people who have them and I can get one pretty simple um, because people are like, oh, I have that and I was going to get rid of it. So you can have it. So no big deal. Now what I do with my... Um, with my unpaper towels throughout the day is when I'm using them, I leave it just over my sink like so. So it's not, it's not real hard and um, it kind of dries there. So as I need it, I will use it. If it gets funky and I'm done with it and I'm ready to toss it, I toss it into a bin that is right under my sink. So um, I just open my sink and I have this handy dandy waste basket. So, and I put them actually over the side of the waste basket overnight. And then when they're dry in the morning, I toss them inside. So usually I do laundry on Wednesdays when I do my laundry I'll throw them in um, and if not if I need them sooner I'll just throw in a little small load or hand wash some whatever but I dry them before I throw them in the bin and that way they don't get all stinky and kind of icky in there and mildewy so anyways that's what I do it's just a little um, office waste paper um, bin so I just bought it at the store you can get whatever you'd like um, I know people who just use empty um, coffee, um, empty coffee cans or, you know, even like a big bowl that they don't use very often in their house. So at any rate, that's what I do and it works for us. So I hope that you enjoyed that. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments and I will get to them as soon as possible. Thanks and I will see you later. Bye.